It's funny how things change in about a span of a year. Guess I didn't see it coming. Now there's blessings in here. How do you create awesome content on a GoPro at night? I may have 99 problems, but my faith ain't one. And if I always try to solve them, what is faith in one? It's called a night lapse. <laughs> it's definitely called a night lapse, and we're not professionals at it. Actually, we've never really managed to get a good one, but that's because we haven't really tried. <laughs> We thought this would be a really fun way to start the video. Either fun or terrifying. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Oh, so basically you can't camp here. You can't have fires. You can't swim. You can't have a camping van, which is this, this, this. But let's see if you can paddle. <laughs> I was not expecting it to go that quick. I actually thought that would take a lot longer to pump up. made it out onto the middle of the lake. I'm gonna to switch to 360 to give you a better perspective. Coming to find some greener grass. <laughs> anyway, this has got to be one of the most incredible places I've ever paddle boarded. It's just 360 degrees of beautiful mountains. I got this paddleboard from the guys at Outdoor Master. I'll put a link in the description of the, the vlog. But if you're chasing a stand-up paddleboard, an inflatable one which you can travel with like this, they've got all you, they've got everything. So check them out. Oh. Yeah, look at that little sandwich. Ready to go. It also comes with this bag, so travel case, pump, Whoa, pretty awesome, go. pretty awesome accessory to bring if you're like going to mountains or you know if you're on a road trip. So I'm filming with the Max because I lost, we lost a GoPro Hero 9. Mm. It's a whole nother story. Should it be? There's a whole vlog in that. Anyway, so I'm using the Max and the Hero 9 for this, pretty much this entire video. But I just want to show you the mounting setup for this, for this, uh, first. Give me something So that's that And goodbye to your mom and dad 
Now I've got no real idea as to how that is going to turn out. So that's that. So I'll just run you through what we're bringing for this is just a two-day hike so it's one overnight we're sleeping in a tent one night and then that's all we're bringing let's look at it Maybe it's like, maybe it's under, maybe it's like 20. These bags and all this gear that you're seeing is all by this Swedish company called Haglofs. They're an outdoors hiking um, and mostly ski outdoors wear, which Anna has been commissioned to create a film. So I'm her production assistant. Also what I'll be taking in my pack will be these, these, like, which is probably an extra, 10 kilos. Here's a taste of the mountains also. Those mountains up there, those mountains all the way up there. So the game plan is to leave tomorrow at... We're leaving at... 6.30, the campground. Okay. The highest waterfall of all of Europe in a single fall. That is. Givan? Gavani. Gavani? Cirque du Gavani. Trekking with uh, a 30 kilo backpack. Different, eh? It's different. <laughs> it's like not a gear bag, you know? It's like a full on tent. <sighs> but we finally made the plateau. Obviously, we stopped and filmed a lot, so it took us about an hour. Most people, it would probably take them 40, maybe 30 minutes. Look at this. Baguette's my favorite thing and I cannot wait to eat it. We haven't really managed to capture that many night lapses, <laughs> which is the whole point of this video, um, because we've been immersed in, voila, these mountains. But the good news is that I have officially packed everything that we need to be in complete darkness. Um, I think- You packed everything for complete darkness? <laughs> yeah, so we essentially, so we're in the wilderness um, yeah. and there's our best, best possible chance of having no light pollution For sure. so Tonight. that the stars look amazing. I wonder if the horse is like edible. Yeah? Well over 20,000 steps on the Fitbit. All right, the, uh, the count is... 21,655 steps. <sighs> Doing it for the star lapses. Pitched. Tent pitched. Tent pitched. Okay, a little bit of gas out. You can't heat this. Oh! Oh, wait, oh, here we go. Like here? Yeah, yeah. That is hot. Good, we want it hot. We don't want it no other way.
call it bolognese in a bag. They do not call it anything. It didn't exist. <laughs> Apparently, you just boil the water, you pour it in, and hunky dory. Oh, for shit, s'il te plaît. Animals have suffered for this. What do we think? You know what? I have zero clue as to which way to orient the the camera. Like I'm sure people that are really good at doing this would probably know. Okay, the moon rises over there or like, you know, the Milky Way is over here. So maybe there's like an app for that if there is... Stargazer. <laughs> Stargazer. <laughs> And it says Stargazer, so maybe I should experiment with that tomorrow night or the night after. But tonight's one, we just, I've got no idea, so I'm just going to face it towards the mountains. Hopefully it frames up really nicely and we get something awesome. I'll be in my room with my door closed. I don't know good, homie, Lord knows. I sweat good, it's real hot. Stepping on y'all like hopscotch. I can tell you scared sitting in these nuts. If we ain't in the hood, what's that pop pop? Hear that? You do though. They recognize you. Kudos. Throwing flames. Zuko. I'm off planet. Bruno. My God really do rain. So, how was your camping experience? Oh my God, it was windy last night. I couldn't sleep because of all the wind. <laughs> well, welcome to the wilderness. It's romantic. Yeah. Really warm. Yeah, which... Hagloff sleeping bags. 100% recommend. Yeah. It's like a goose down, like. A goose down. I can't think I let the stars for the pretty skies. Now I gotta work on my skin. And I go driving in the dark, pull over the park, fighting that feeling again. We like Kaupu. Kaupu's great. How nice is the the morning this morning? Oh. All right, we're going down in the valley where it's super foggy. Down there. Back to Gavarni. Um, yeah, I mean it was a good hike. I'm tired, so I think this was a good intro. <laughs> options right either we go around the path here and keep going up or we go to the zone where there's no path on oh, left hand Hotel side Hotel Rue du Lac de Gaube Gaube Lac de Gaube welcome to the Lac de Gaube <laughs> So blue. Blue. That's a blue lake. There's a walking track which takes you on this side of the lake all the way around. There's no walking track here. So we've just come away from the hordes. It's quite a few people. It's August, as we said, middle of summer, French holidays. Come to the final night lapse of this experimental cinematic GoPro vlog. So 
wrapping up this video, I wanted to share with you three take homes from attempting to create a GoPro night lapse. Now, the first of which is to start with auto. Just start with auto and then refine your settings from there. One thing that I found that worked was maybe changing the shutter, having a longer shutter, say 30 seconds if it was darker, worked really well. The second notable item uh, would be to use a power bank. Make sure you film the entire night. The longer um, that you have the GoPro running, the more opportunity that you have of capturing something awesome and lastly it's to focus on your composition i know that's super hard but if you can try and frame up something like you know just like this like a little bit of this valley but mostly sky not like mostly ground and just sky but more sky than valley and having some kind of reference point in it i think looks really cool guys thank you so much for watching this video if you have learned something punch that thumbs up button thank you to um oh and if you're looking to me? yeah thank you to anna for helping and for making all of these adventures so much more enjoyable and thank you and if you guys are looking for a place to stay if you are camping through the pyrenees check out park for night because you can find awesome parks like this and you can park your van in somewhere beautiful like this um for the night um yeah thanks for sharing the soak and i'll see you guys in the next upload jr Peace. Oh.